Mate, that's a proper bike. That, that's, that's a conga that is, mate. Conger on? Yeah, conger on. Conger on. Happy days, mate. Well, then. Hello! <laughs> We're back off again. We're off to Amlick. Right, I'll keep this short and sweet. It's three o'clock now. I tidies at seven tonight. We're aiming for the breakwater, but it's Saturday, so it could well be busy. So we might fish off towards Mouse Island and off the rocks. Conger, Huss. Codder, codder about, Cod. we've got a few yeah. different, we're not Cod. just flat out for congas tonight, anything will do, but congas the target, so yeah, I ain't gonna bore you, I'll see you when we get to Hamlick and um, we'll assess the situation. And here we go, is there anybody there or not? <laughs> that is the question. This is the question, the mighty Hamlick Harbour. Oh, there's a couple of cars there, there's a couple of people there. But they're only halfway down the breakwater, so the end's free. But we're still gonna go and have a little walk, I think. Go and see what's what. What's popping, who's what, this is where, what, what. That's where we was fishing from the other day, off that point there, by that house. Or whatever it is, harbour, house, or whatever. Right, uh, so we're gonna get the van unpacked, and uh, well, I don't know, we might have a walk. I'll let you know the plan anyway. Stay with us, people, but we're here now. Gonna have it. Mike's rods are in. They are. They are indeed. They're in. Just about to get mine in. The left rod. We're on the end of the bright water. There's a couple of lads there. A couple of lads there. Both follow the channel and both watch videos, <laughs> which is good. Uh, if they get anything, hopefully I can report to you and show you what they get. But my left rod is going sort of out towards the rocks, and that's going to be on a pulley panel with a big squid, big dirty squid. The right rod is going to be over towards them rocks, just on the inside of the arbor, with a running rig and a mackerel head. So yeah, I'm going to get them in. There's a big fire over there in the building, I don't know if you've seen the smoke and that, there's a big fire. But yeah, we're going to get the rods in now. So the first bit of action of the night was on Mike's left hand rod. What could it be? Session out there tonight, isn't it? We swallowed that as well. Look, swallowed it. Ah, oh dear, a bit of bait elastic there and everything. Got a fun one, but a little doggy. Next up was my left rod. I had a similar bike. Oh, here we go. Look, here we go. I'm on that left one. Here we go. That's looking very doggy, yeah. Here we go. Your bait on? Yeah. On your one as well, yeah? Doggy, turn you around here. John's into a doggy, he thinks. Doggy, do it to Nettie. Yeah. Hey? <laughs> oh, he's just fell off. Oh, he's got him. I've got him, though. <laughs> he's counting. Yeah, he's got one. The conga, the Well, you big rods off? <laughs> he's all going off here. Yeah, check that one. That's a big conga bite, that. Well, nothing that time for Mike on that bite, but for me, it was a snag! Yeah, yeah, a little bit of action on my other rod here before I could get the one back in that I just had the fish on. But I'm not sure what Mike's doing. He's out of shot here, hiding. And all as I can keep hearing him saying is, I've got to pull on my conga. I've got to pull on my conga. Mike, what the hell are you doing? Conger on? Yeah, Conger on. Conger on. Happy days, mate. Conger on. Conger on. Happy days, mate. Conger on. 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 Conger on
And there we go. <laughs> Target achieved. Got the first conger of the night. Hopefully many, many more. But yeah, I give him about six pound. I'll give you four. Four pounds. <laughs> Whatever you give him. Oh, first conger. Send him down head first. Off he goes. He's gone. He ain't hanging around. Straight to my base. Straight to your base. Well in, mate. Well in, well, mate. Nice slimy, <laughs> dirty, <laughs> stinky. Hey, yeah, you've had worse. Come, yeah. Come, slime. Next up Come. was my left rod. Two off, conga. Conga, 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 conga. That chocolate's on Typical dogfish looking bite that materialised into nothing. Right, what Mike's gonna do now is check his shrimp pot out. Here he comes. <laughs> <laughs> Looks empty, mate. Don't pull it off. Not a single. Oh, there's one again. Oh, there's one. <laughs> oh, no, two, there's three, two. four. Yay! Four. I was expecting about 50 in there. We've got four though, it's better than me, better than my first one, wasn't it? Yeah. Well they're down there anyway, so I'm lowering it back down because I want a few more than that. So <laughs> four, I want a decent there, uh, playful anyway. You're on 40. <laughs> if you can get a decent amount tonight, we'll do a little catching cup for you. Fish on! <laughs> I wonder what this could be. <laughs> can you guess? Cheers, Mike, the best drop net man in North Wales, bar none. Fish is a fish, isn't it? Fish is a fish. So what are we now, about an hour and a half in, two hours? Mike's had a doggy, a conger. I've had a couple of doggies. <laughs> no conger yet though, I'll say yet. Yes. <laughs> the lads behind hooked into what we all thought was a good fish, so me and Mike offered our assistance and took the drop net over. I climbed on the wall here to have a little look over to see what it was. Kids, don't try this at home. It can be extremely dangerous. And um, yeah, the fish ended up being a dogfish. <laughs> After all the hype, it was a big one. And again, the rods behind us from the other guys, one of them was into a fish and it looked like a hell of a fish again, bouncing, nodding, pulling back. What could it be? Unfortunately, this fish snagged up. It's just lost a big fish there. Carnage from the lads behind us, one fish in a snag and another fish on another rod. That's on that one. That, one, that big one he's got still in the snag. Got another, another one on the other rod. Weather's horrendous now. Drop net Mike to the rescue. Steady on lads, steady on. Do not try this at home. Standing on the harbour wall can be extremely dangerous. Oh, that, white, that rain is horrendous. <laughs> what is it? Walk back a little bit towards me. Teamwork. Makes a dream work. That's it, isn't it? You got it? And kids, don't try this at home. <laughs> got to point that out. <laughs> Got it? Don't 
talking. Don't try this at home, kids. Well, yeah. Nice Don't job, mate. With this rope now. <laughs> it's picked up rough now. We haven't had a bite for a bit. The camera's not doing it justice. <laughs> uh, I think everybody is soaked through. I think we're all soaked. I think the jack could be on the cards, couldn't it? looking that way it's looking like we could be jacking it yeah the problem is when you're filming as well it's hard because yeah. all, your, all your equipment gets wet <laughs> right let's keep this short and sweet game over weather was horrendous mr tasker got a conga come on we had a few doggies the other lads had a few fish and lost a few fish uh it wasn't a bad little session it's real fishing people see you all in the next video yeah.